there comes a point in time when a man realizes he has too many AV equipment. That's my crisis. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Sprite's channel. And today is, is, is a... Is a I know in the past video, I, I know you guys saw me. I was a little upset or whatever. A little bummed out because of this. I brought uh, Emotiva A2. I mean, not A2, A4. To run my rear speakers in... Um, when my rest pick is in by amping mode but as you can see I don't have any space for it I tried it over here and it was like it's basically the size of the amp down there it reaches all the way out over here which is weird because the, the Opal over here just stops right there so it just looks weird with it just right here by itself so I'm a guy that likes symmetry and I was thinking about putting it over here, but bringing the Oppo here to kind of make it match a little bit. But I decided to do something else, which are these. So I brought a, a stand for the center speaker. And my plan is to oh, also brought another fan for it. Another air, air com, um fan to go on top of it. I know these amps don't really run that hot because of... Um, it's a b and it's a small wattage and everything but since it's going to be under this thing i decided to give it a little breathing space but oh disclaimer I, I i um i have a fan running on the background so i don't know how clear you guys can hear me so forgive me if it's if you're hearing the fan in the back but um yeah so i brought that stand to put over under the center speaker and put that fan under it and then the, put the amp there. So um, I'm gonna test fit it right now because I really don't feel like going behind there and doing all of that. So I'm just gonna test fit it and see how it is. And honestly, if it's, if it's ugly, I might do my first plan, which was putting the amp here and pushing the, the Oppo up more to match it. But um, yeah, so that's it. I brought the wires and everything for it. You know, you need extra wires when you're gonna be running in um in bi amping mode. So that's that's what all those wires is for. But yeah, so let me unpack these things. I'm not gonna do unboxing. I'm sure you. I had like mad unboxings on that, and that's just a regular stand. So let me do that and test fit it and show you guys the outcome. I, I, like I said, if I like it, I'm going to keep it. But if I don't, I'm honestly going to just return it and do my first thing. But even so, I know you guys saw my, my last video with how nice and neat I did everything back there. But I have to go back there again just to move the speaker wires and stuff. That's going to take me like, God knows how long that's going to take me now. But um, I'm just going to do it. If you're in this home theater thing, you know how it is, brother. You got to keep on upgrading or adding stuff to your system just to try to be happy. But I don't want... I People are telling me to get a rack. I really don't want a rack in the living room because it, it might look a little weird. Just a big old rack in this corner over here. So I might not do it because I want it to look somewhat living room-ish still. That's why all the the amp stuff is like at the bottom, like not too in like boom in your face. But I'm just gonna hook it up and I show you guys how it looks. So so literally this is the stand right here. It took I would say maybe a minute and a half to to make. It's only like four or five screws and it was all together. They are like three, four, five, six, seven. Seven screws and it was put together. I tried to make it match the table over here, the closest it got, but let's hope it, it looks decent. Sad news, people. Just open the box and there's damage. Let me see if I can focus. 
hopefully you guys can see a little better. Yeah. So I'm still gonna test fit it, but this will be returned, uh, which sucks. But it seems like it was damaged upon shipping, and this is this 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 really deep. So I am gonna return this back to Amazon and get in another one. I'm still gonna test fit it for you guys, so we all can see it how it is. So is the finished product it looks ugly and it looks crappy and I'm returning it there's a hundred million things wrong with this whole setup right here and let's just start off by pointing them the obvious thing out it's floating it's not even touching touching the ground second of all the fan is exposed right here, which is very ugly to me. The sticker is all exposed. I can't bring it up forward because there's like a, a plaque on the back of the, let's see if you see it, there's a plaque up there in the back of it that's stopping it. And if I move it forward, it's gonna lean forward. The speaker is gonna slide off. Secondly, I don't know if you can tell, but I, I over, I misjudge the length of it just by a couple centimeters but it is blocking the screen and not all my movies are you know not full screen or are 20 what is it the the black bars and stuff not all movies are with the black bars but um it's blocking the screen so it's blocking the screen it's floating stickers are exposed on the fan and it just looks butt ugly. So this is a no-go. I'm gonna have to do what I plan on doing in the beginning. And if that looks ugly, I'm gonna have to cave into a rack. I can't believe I even did this. This is this this looks horrible. So um I'm just gonna move the the OPPO up here and let the amp sit right there. Move it up. So yeah, this is a complete fail, and I'm sorry for putting you guys through this, <laughs> but it looks butt ugly. And on top of it, it's not even it's not even like a gap or anything. And that huge split right there it's on the fan is just today was a complete fail. But anyway, on a positive note now, the giveaway September 1st. I think I think that's a Thursday. Is it a Thursday? yeah Thursday so all you guys who are watching this video that are subscribed to me and want to win the free pairs of um, power cables go back to the video type in what you got to be subscribed you gotta like the video and in a message or in the comment section let me know what you want to use the cord for and you're automatically entered. So Wednesday and then Thursday, I don't know if I'm gonna do it morning. Most likely in the afternoon, I'll probably do the drawing, which is gonna be me basically writing the name of all who commented that are subscribed and they leave a message. And I'm just gonna throw them in a bowl and randomly pick the name and whoever the winner is will go from there. So September 1st is the drawing for the two power cables. So, uh, complete failure. I'm going to have to do everything over again. But, like I said, it comes a point in time when you realize you have too much AV stuff. Or, your room is not big enough for all this AV stuff. So, thanks for watching, guys. And, I know that what you're looking at is butt ugly right now, but... Sorry about that. Anyway, like, subscribe, share this video <laughs> so people can realize sometimes more is not better. And that's all I'm going to say. Anyway, you guys take care. Peace. Remember, giveaway, September 1st.